Okay, so you want to learn how to factor completely trinomials that have power is greater than 2. For instance, this 9z to the 4th minus 60z to the 2nd plus 100 could be factored. Uh, first thing I want to do is make my pair of parentheses. What could go in this spot, also in this spot, that if I multiply it by itself, it would give me this first term. I uh, could see that that's going to be a 3, z, z here, and the square root of 4 is 2 and 2. Now I take a look at these signs in the middle. Okay, this sign and this sign, this plus, sometimes symbolizes that the sign will be the same of whatever that's here. So since this is a negative, I put a negative here and a negative there. Now I take the square root of this last number, if possible, whatever multiply itself could give me this. And I can see that it's going to be a 10. Now I do my check. Will that equal up to this trinomial? Uh, by checking, I use the Fourier method. Okay, so we're going to just rewrite that quickly for you. Now, first times first terms times that. That's 9z4 first outer so 9z4 times 30z2 inner minus another 30z2 last that's a plus 100 and there you go that looks like it's going to equal up the same thing because when you combine like terms you get the same thing back where we started. Okay, there you have it. How to factor completely. You are uh, trinomials that have powers greater than two. Thank you, goodbye.